there's something yeah. around here. Oh, we're cold then. Yeah. Yeah? I think you said your name. Hi. Yeah. Hi. Down. Oh, yes, very clear, yes. Yeah? Um, they turn the lights off downstairs and then they hear banging from this door, um, and so they don't like coming back up. So once they've gone, they like to be gone and not come back up here. The team are extremely scared of that kind of area as well. Um, they've kind of said that they don't really want to do the meter readings at night time too often. Um, so it's normally my job now. Are you happy that it's now an ice cream parlour instead of a pub? I'm in. So they were throwing like that. Look at that. Look at that. No, 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 no. Oh. Both. Tonight, we are investigating at this charming establishment, which sends forth the essence of yesteryears located in the building known as the former Red Cow Pub in Hitchens Market Square. The Red Cow spoke of a deep-seated history, with the carved numbers 1676 on the bottom stair symbolising its age-old existence. The former pub boasts mysterious cellars under the town's pavements, emitting an eerie dampness, while its structure stands tall with three floors. From historical records, we learn that this building once had a balcony, offering panoramic views of the bustling marketplace during historical events, such as Queen Victoria's Jubilees in the years 1887 and 1897. Interestingly, a hidden spy hole, complete with a shutter and reinforcements, was discreetly tucked behind the balcony's room. This spy hole is thought to be a relic from a time when women needed to quickly adapt to unexpected appearances by the town's constables. The Red Cow's history is intriguing, as it seems to be intertwined with another establishment known as the Red House, found in the same marketplace. Research revealed that both the Red Cow and the Red House were owned by Robert Crofts in 1731 later passed on to his son, Richard, in 1763. Adding more mystery to the mix, a pub sharing the same name was reportedly present in Walsworth in 1730. Well, it's another dark cold evening here in Hitchin Town Centre. Now tonight we're at Fabio's in the old market square. This building dates back nearly 500 years. Over that time it's been a pub. A clothes shop. A wine distributors. I mean staff here have reported all sorts of strange things going on. Uneasy atmospheres in rooms. Orb spotting on the CCTV. I mean there's loads of stuff going on here. We're here to investigate. My name's Ray Cordell. This is Beth Kinsey. We are haunted hitching. Oh, that's nice. Oh, yeah. That was Bev. Bev. <gasps> yes. Oh. Ray. 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 Bev. Bev. Yeah, it's good. Good to be here. Are you here? Yes? No? Yeah. That's moving. <gasps> Can you go back the other way? Hitchens Market dates back to at least the 12th century, and although the market itself has been relocated, this square remains very much at the heart of the town's social and commercial activities. The Corn Exchange uh, symbolises the prosperity and optimism of the town, when, in the 1850s, the railway extended the reach of Hitchens traders. 
Around the corner is the High Street, where the great and the good would once have lived. However, just a stone's throw in the other direction were the infamous Dead Street slums, where poverty, overcrowding and disease were widespread. The haves and the have-nots lived very different lives, but just a few yards apart. In the middle of the 1800s, this market square really bridged those two worlds. In amongst the prosperous businesses fronting the square, and in the yards and alleyways leading from it, were a scattering of ramshackle cottages, where casual labourers and their families eked out a breadline existence. In William Ranger's public health report of 1848, he details the overcrowding, the disease, the, the poor sanitation of these slum areas. In Marketplace, he records, there are eight privies in cellars and five houses in which the occupiers make use of boxes, wooden boxes for toilet facilities. Pretty primitive. There must have been a great deal of social tension within this community where the rich and poor lived cheek by jowl. Have any of those animosities, those fears and hardships left any echoes for our intrepid investigators to discover here at Fabiage this evening? We are with Fabio and this is where you had an incident happen here with the, the kitchen door, is that right? Yeah, our team, when they go home at night, um, they turn the lights off downstairs and then they hear banging from this door um, and so they don't like coming back up. So once they've gone, they like to be gone and not come back up here. So this is when it gets, when it's dark or just... Yeah, so they, they hit the kill switch downstairs for the lights, it goes pitch black dark. Um, and then they hear this door bang, like something's up here moving, trying to get out. So they, they don't like to turn the light back on and come back up. This is the door. Um, so when it bangs, how loud does it bang? Shall we see if we can... So it's on a soft close, so it doesn't really bang. So the, but the only time it bangs be like a big that. bang if it's, this is what they hear from downstairs. So it's like it's being physically done. We're in the attic area and you've had something happen here? Yeah, nothing's happened in the attic, um, but no one likes coming up here. We don't have any storage up here. Um, occasionally you've got to come and check the fire alarms up here. And when you do come up, it's always cold, it's eerie, it's dusty. No one likes coming up here. Um, you won't catch me up here at night, 100% um, dull. We're down in the basement now with Hannah. And what do you feel when you come down here? Um, well, we try not to come down here too often. Um, when we do, we just come down normally to check the electric meter, um, but we won't go anywhere near that area over there. So what there. is that? That looks like a bit of a, a tunnel going on for the road. Yeah, isn't it? so apparently in the olden days, they would bring the barrels in from the street um, underneath um, and bring them in into the basement. But as you can see, it's very like dark and scary and the, the team just will not come down here, especially if I've asked them to do the meter reading at night time, um, they will avoid that area at all costs. And also the staircase that goes to nowhere. Oh, um, I was looking at that earlier. Yeah. Yes, it's like it literally just stops. Yeah. Um, and, you know, we've kind of, the team are extremely scared of that kind of area as well. Um, they've kind of said that they don't really want to do the meter readings at night time too often. Um, so it's normally my job now. And then there's been a few occasions upstairs. Um, we haven't got CCTV in the basement, but I've logged in at night time just to check everything's okay with the shop. And um, I've seen like orbs on the night vision camera, like going across the screen, especially right. upstairs, in the upstairs like staff room area and in the kitchen. So a lot of activity sort of yeah, going on Yeah, where the there. noises have been heard as well. That's when we've seen on the camera, like some of the flashes like go past the screen. Cool, so have you just followed me? Okay. We so we're heading towards what you said, the, this is the event room? Yes, yeah, so um, this is normally where we hold um, private parties and um, events for children at the weekend, um, or we can use it as additional seating when we're really busy. This is a really good space, yeah, but you really found good. something here, didn't you? Yeah, when yeah. we were renovating, um, the whole room needed to be stripped back, so we took all the wallpaper off about six or seven layers. Um, and on one side there was water coming in oh. and then on the other side here the um, skirting board was all out at a funny angle so um, we excavated behind the skirting board to straighten it all up and we found quite a few old coins behind there oh right um, which we can only presume is when it used to be a pub they were just 
in this corner here, just like behind the skirting board, which we've like made all straight now. Um, and then we also, when we were first looking around the premises, um, up in the loft, we found a really dusty old, um, scary looking book. Um, and then when we moved in and went back up there, it disappeared. And this, this also, you said that you think there might be something actually behind there. Yeah, so this is all hollow, this wall here that okay. we had um, graffitied. Um, and we're pretty sure there's a fireplace behind there. Ah, oh, okay. Yeah, hidden. So I wonder if that was part of the, yeah. part of the pub. And this beam here, um, when we first started in the renovations, we didn't even know there was a wooden beam here. Um, mm -hmm. It had been completely covered up and wallpapered. So we took off about five or six layers of wallpaper and we found the wooden beam, which exposed. <laughs> You're going to keep finding things, aren't yeah, you? Yeah, I know. I, I think there's a, this building's got a lot hid, like there's yes. a lot of like hidden secrets in this building. Yeah. It's a, a bit of a rabbit warren as well. Once you get look, start looking, um, we've only renovated this floor. We haven't done the upstairs yet. Oh, it's be exciting. Yeah. Who knows what we'll find? <laughs> when they took the, when they took, would have done the building, they would have done it. Um, they just boxed everything out to make it as square as possible yes. to make it easy to use. Um, but yeah. actually, um, there's a lot more behind that the meets the eye with an old building. Who yes, knows what's behind all the walls? It's going to be fascinating, <laughs> yeah. isn't it, to see how it's all going to come up in the attic space. Yeah. I've never been up there. Oh, no. that's something that we have to, <laughs> yeah, we'll have to investigate one day. Yeah. <laughs> have you got any spirit people here who'd like to contact us? Got a message for you here. So, have we got a, a male spirit with us here? Okay. Oh, thank you. You're getting a bit stronger. Can you feel it getting stronger? Yes. <laughs> okay. Is this a message actually for Fabio? You got um. Granddad is in the spirit world? Yeah. Okay. I've got your granddad here. Um, hello. Night. Thank you very much for coming through. So let's say hello. <laughs> and say hello to someone. Yes. Hello, T. Say hello. O. A. Say hello to the gang. Does that make sense to you? I'm not sure. No. <laughs> Would you say that? Uh, probably not. <laughs> But it could be just short term for fact. I don't know if it's quicker to spell out in the family. <laughs> it's now going to. He's going for it now. He's a bit annoyed that. Yeah, yeah. Yes. He was saying, say yeah. hello to the family. Yes. <laughs> okay. Well, thank you very much for coming through. Find some ghosts. Yeah. Who have we got with us here? We've got the landlord or who, who was here before? Mike, are you actually in this building with us now? Are you, are you here? Are you haunting this building? We'll be able to see you around here when we do our investigation. Thank you. Our immediate interpretations of voices from the spirit box can potentially be prone to inaccuracies and may lead to inappropriate responses from us, or we might totally miss what was said. For a more accurate understanding, we must review and audibly enhance the recorded footage for greater clarity. So Fabio, we've done the um, service. 
Well, now we've got the spirit box running. Um, there's a few names that came up from the seance. Your granddad? So my granddad popped up, um, and we had a guy called Mike pop up, which we think worked at the pub, because uh, like, this was previously a pub. Now, this is a good opportunity to maybe ask if, if he's here, or maybe call him and see if Eric... Is it Eric? Eric was my granddad, yeah. yeah. So, Eric, are you, are you there? Something there, yeah. Something there. Might be it's Mike. Oh, just a slight, slight. Was that a mic? No. Did you slip? Someone bangs the door up here, so we don't know who does that either. Okay, so is Mike here with us? Hey. That was a hay. Just that like a whistle. Yeah, hey. yeah. There's a lot bubbling under the surface as well. <laughs> yeah. Is anyone else here who maybe used to work here or live here? Eric, are you here? Would you like to say hello to Fabio? It's a whistle. That's a whistle. Yeah. He did, he did, we did have a dog that he would do a whistle, like quite a loud whistle for. He was quite, he was quite known for doing it. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Are you whistling? Whistling your dog? Strange, the dog was called Whiskey, which is obviously a bit pub related. Yeah. So I don't know if it's, it's looking for the dog. Are you looking for your dog? Is there anyone else here who'd like to give a name or say hello? You hear loud sounds, but there's a lot under the surface. Yeah. Which when we enhance the sound yeah, later, pick up. you pick it up. It's amazing some of the things you pick up. Whistle again? It's definite whistles. Are you from Hitchin? That was definitely a help, yeah. Are you in trouble? Are you here with us? Did you used to live here? Is it? Yeah. Is it Mike? So many years ago, it was a pub. So, I mean, you think how many people have passed through here. Did you used to drink here? Yep. That was a woman, yes. Did you used to work at the pub? Ooh. Yeah, yeah. Do you watch Fabio working every day? Is a yes, yeah. And a whistle. A whistle. Lots of whistles. Mm. Are you happy that it's now an ice cream parlour instead of a pub? Could have been yes.
we have recently begun experimenting with an innovative technique during our investigations involving the use of the spirit box. To the best of our knowledge, this methodology does not appear to be commonly practiced elsewhere. Rather than utilizing the speaker as is conventionally done, we have configured a direct line from the spirit box to one of our camera's audio channels. We're going to have a little chat, yeah. so we're going to head towards the... OK. Oh, hi. OK. Oh. You got it? Yeah, that's it. OK. You got it? Yeah, you bet it don't that. Is that it? Do you want well. me to go first? Uh, I'll let you go first, Ray. I'll go for it. It's a bit steep. Be careful. Yeah, it's okay. I'm in. Yes. Okay, Bev. Oh, this is quite fascinating, isn't it? Wow. So what we've got, we've got some a staircase here. So that... up here, it, there's a staircase going up. But it doesn't go anywhere. But it doesn't go anywhere. Yeah. But that obviously used to go up to the floor above, possibly. Perhaps when um, yeah. the beer cans and came down. And then over here, what is that? What? Oh my God. Wow. This looks like it's probably, oh, mind your, your head. Yeah. Ooh. This looks like it, it's under the stairs, under the street. A bit there. <laughs> I mean, this, this, it looks like you're in the 1500s here, doesn't it? It does. And there's no door or anything to it, is there? No. No. So, is there anyone down here with us? So, if there's anything on the box. Oh, oh, la, 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 la. We're getting something. Are you going up? Yeah, 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 yeah. There, Tony. Yeah. She's got a yes, I think. Are you are you here with us now? Yeah, mine's going up now. Yeah. Yeah, there, there. There's someone here with us now. Can you make a noise? Can you do some tapping? There's definitely a presence here. Yeah. Tony, Tony. There. Let's go mad. I can feel something next to me, you know. It's, it's, it's almost like you sent something there. Wow. You get anything better? Yeah, mine's going off too. What's your name? Oh, look! Oh, it went off the scale. It went off the scale. Wow. If someone's walk, just walked through us. Yeah. They've just oh. walked. Whoa, oh. there's something around here. Oh, God, we're cold then. Wow. There's a lot of people down here, look. Yeah. Okay. There's someone here with us now. Why don't you throw something? There's lots of debris down here. It's there. It's there. I'm coming down, right? Okay. Watch your step. Ooh. Okay. Whoa. It's just on that doorway, isn't it? You're here with us now, aren't you? What's your name? Do you used to work here? Sure, what this is. Because it looks like almost it could be a towel to something. 
Yeah. Because I like, was thinking that in this space is maybe where they used to drop the beer barrels in yeah. for the pub. But there's no, I don't know if But there's not, there doesn't seem to be a natural, um, like a trap door to go up to the street. No. Looks almost like it. It's been blocked off. Yeah. So they were throwing like that. Look at that, no, 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 no. Oh. Both. Someone's standing right next to us here. Okay, why don't you touch one of us then? If you're quite near us. That's weird. Yeah, and it's uh, the thing that there's actual three lights. Yeah. Four three lights and my three lights. Whoa. Comes back when you go here. They're standing it's here. It's a doorway here. You standing right next to us? What's your name? They're there, aren't they? There's a lot of chatter, but I can't make no. out any words. I can, f I can just feel it. I can feel something's here. Someone's here. And we always, we often talk about temperature, don't we? But it's kind of, and it's cold down here. Oh. But actually, it's. You know, my nose has got very cold. There used to be a light down here, didn't yeah. there? Okay, if you're down here with us now, which we think you are, can you actually throw something or touch one of us? Or make a sound? It's just, it's just here, isn't it? I mean, there's absolutely nothing around here because we are literally in the in the tunnel come on move something for us be careful of the hole down there yeah yeah i think it said your name bev are you are you saying hello to bev Are you wow. standing near me? Is that what it is? Yeah. Now this is exceptional readers. Yes. You're standing near me. You're standing next to. Yeah. Is is here? Was around up near us? Yes. Yes. Okay. Well, why don't you touch us? Touch me or Ray. Come on. We know definitely you're here then. It's all around this area here. And I, I, the strongest I felt was there when I stood. It's like someone was standing next to me. Go and stand there, Beth. Watch that hole. Yeah, 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 yeah. There. Yeah. And on the same, look, there's someone here, right here. Are you standing in between us? What's your name? I'm just wondering if the temperature's changed a little bit, but it's... Stop. Yeah? Yeah. yeah. Do you want us to get out? Can you see if you can make the meter go into the red? How many of you are down here? There's no one here. It's not at the back. Well, you're it's going a little it's bit definitely more. here. Oh, look! <gasps> oh. oh! Wow. You're standing... Oh, right. Wow. Wow. <gasps> wow. That was off the scale. I asked them to go to the red and they went to the red. Wow. That was crazy. Yeah, that was. <laughs> wow, you're obviously around here. Okay, if we turn our torches off, can you actually touch one of us? What's your name? Oh, there we go. Oh, I felt like somebody touched my head. Yeah? Yeah, top of my head. And we've both got the same. Oh! 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 Whoa, whoa. Oh! Wow! There's definitely a presence in here, isn't there? Yeah. There definitely is. 
Well, great, but why don't you do something? Can you make a sound? Just keep quiet. Oh, wow. Huh? Wow. What is that? Wow, again, again. You're standing right near us. I think something touched the top of my head. <laughs> what are you saying, Jim? Yeah, yeah, I felt yeah, something's touched me top of my head. Okay, do that again. Oh, wow. whoa. Oh, God. I think they're both the same, aren't they? Yeah. It's yeah. Just happy. So it's they're standing right there. It's near right us. there. It's right there. Are you looking at us? I think we're being watched now. Yeah. Come on, can you see if you can make a sound for us? <laughs> It's really going. This phenomenal results, this. Mm. There's definitely someone here. Or people here. There's people here. I, yeah. I, I think you're right, Ray. I think there's people. It doesn't feel like just one. It feels like many. Yeah. They seem to be kind of... I feel like, like you earlier, Ray, it feels like we're being watched now, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah. There's a spot here which just feels so uneasy. I get that uneasy sort of feeling. You can't explain it. Yeah. <laughs> I just keep now. I don't know whether I'm touching the ceiling or not, but I feel it's like. Fun, do you? Yeah. Yeah. Do you? I feel, I'm touching my head. Are you touching my head? Yes. Yeah. I feel like someone's touching my head. Yeah, you're you're well clear of the ceiling. I'm well clear of it. Yeah. Yeah. To the top of my hair. Oh, something there. Yeah? I'm sure what it was. Noise. It's on the rear. Should we go out? I'm gonna get out. Oh. There's another little alleyway off here. <laughs> See, that looks like that could have been a like It's got that sort of tunnel shape that they had at the George. Has yes, it, not? it does. So maybe, and this doesn't, this doesn't look that old. The actual. No, this isn't. But that's look at that, that that curvature. Yeah, that, that does. looks like that could have been a. We've seen those before, Tony. Haven't they? Yeah, that's probably been blocked up. <laughs> probably through there. If we went into the shop next door, it would probably be. A, that probably was the. Yeah. 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 Maybe that's where the barrels came through, do you think? I don't know. The original tile was there as well. Yeah. Oh, that's, that's, that's crazy in there. Mm. What's happening in here? Let's see what's happening. Look at yours, Ray. They're going, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh. Wow. Oh, my word. Are you getting that as well? Yeah, you're getting yeah, that as not, well. Yeah, not. Here. They're all here, aren't they? Yeah, we're being followed. We're being watched. What's your name? Have you got a name? It's still there, still flickering a bit, but it suddenly just must run, reach out and touch you. Yeah, uh, they're, they're walking around us, aren't yeah, they? Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're definitely walking around us. We've got to say, uh, before we carry on, we're trying something again new tonight where Tony's got the spirit box plugged directly into the camera and he's listening in. We can't hear what's being said, but no doubt we'll hear that on playback. Let's go. This is uh. like... <laughs> the activity down here is... It's crazy, it's crazy, isn't it? Yeah. That is crazy. <laughs> what this staircase used to go to? God! Oh, I mean, that's really old, 
Bob, spooky voice, just look. Oh. Come on, make a sound for us. See if you can throw something. That's yeah, That's it strange. has gone. It's, it's quiet. Stop. Stop? Yeah? Do you feel that the, the atmosphere's got heavier as well? Yeah. Is you, yeah, yeah. It, yeah. It's sometimes in between here, isn't it? Kind of affects your eyes a little bit and between in your head. It it's feels very, quite heavy. I, I, it's a very uneasy feeling. I, I wouldn't want to be down here on my own, put it that way. Again. What's it doing? Oh, there. Yeah. And then that wire, that, look, that wire that Where's this? Underneath. Where? There's a wire. Oh, there? Here, yeah. Oh, I didn't see oh, that. Ah. No, not really. Not really, is it? No. no. No, not really. I mean, it's, yeah, there. Yeah. When you, but we're going right up against it. Yeah, but not right I mean, I'm, I'm standing in the, I'm and then standing you're in the here middle of the room. Gonna... You're in the middle of the room there. Yeah. And that was going crazy. Yeah. No, I'm, I'm in here. I've got, I've got two cameras. Oh, it's going crazy again. Look, I've got three. And I'm in the middle of the room. That's crazy. Yeah, the attic's really, looks really good. That, I, I, that is horrible, that space there. Yeah, yeah it's not that nice. That is horrible. What is that? It, look, it looks like some sort of, it could be a cesspit or something. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. It, because it's like an arched um, space. That... That, that definitely is a tunnel going off down there. Mm. That's like you get at the George. Yeah, you're yeah. right, actually. I forgot about Isn't that. It? Yeah. With that right. rounded edges. It's, it's, that is just exactly the same. <laughs> is it? Wow. Gosh. What have we got in here? <gasps> what is in here? What is this place? Sorry. What is it? Looks like if you go straight up, if you go up, Tony, it goes outside. You can see it used to go outside, didn't it? There's like pigeon netting up the top. Yeah? Oh, yes again. Okay. So. We've set upstairs. Oh, there's a real temperature change through here. It is, isn't there? Wow. Where's this going? Uh, this is up to the attic. Okay. Oh my word, this meat is... Given our enduring presence in the basement, we have consistently encountered the utterance of the term up from the spirit box. This phenomenon leads us to believe that we are possibly receiving an invitation or a summons to ascend into the unknown realms of the attic. <gasps> Going up again, yeah? Yeah. Wow. Well, this is step, like stepping back in time. It is. Mind your head on the beams. Yeah. Wow. Hi. Oh, hi. Very clear. Hi there. Yep. Is there anyone in, in here who'd like to speak to us? It's very cold in here. Oh, I'll turn my torch on. Oh, me. 
magical room, though. What's your name? Are you stuck here? Oh. Not really any activity up here. Oh, oh there we go. Oh, it said, I'm sure it said stop, and I was literally about to hit my head on this beam. Wow. Right above me. Wow. We're getting some, uh, wanna, yeah, getting some slight <gasps> readings. Oh my word, did Where's you feel that? that? Did you feel that? Oh. Although oh, that's it's cold. Is. Oh, can you feel that? Yeah. <laughs> wow. But I think it might be coming through there. Oh, I think it's coming through ring. here. What was that? It might be through there somewhere. It's quite open. Oh. Yeah, I can feel it, but I think it's a. Uh... Yeah, look at the. Feel that? Yeah. Getting some readings here. <laughs> It's so cold up here. Is anyone here? I must Hi. Have... Yeah, very clear. What's your name? In the realm of unexpected phrases emerging from the spirit box, hearing the term Facebook certainly ranks highly. This invites the intriguing prospect that our spectral voice may trace its earthly existence to a more recent era. Alternatively, it could hint that they are observing our world. This enigmatic interaction is but a glimpse into the unfathomable mysteries we continue to explore. There's somebody in here with us now. Quick, okay. there's a wind up here, can't you? Yeah, you can feel it, really feel wow. the wind, can't you? Oh, I thought I heard something. Oh, it's the floorboards. This might be the floorboards. It's very creaky up here. Are you watching us? Are you here with us up here? What's the room beyond, Bev? Let's go and explore. Oh, my, the floor's very uneven. Yeah. Put the torch on. Looks like they're doing some work up here. Got some chatter there. Yeah. <laughs> Hey. Are you here with us now? You can hear the church bells quite clearly now. Yeah. They're not following us now. It seems to have stopped. Look at these archways. Maybe an exposed window from years ago. Was that a door downstairs? There was something. Did you hear that noise down there? Yeah, I heard, I heard it like a door closing or something. Is anyone there? It did sound like yeah, a door. Did you hear it? Yeah, I did like hear it. Door, yeah.
I didn't get that. Stop. They're standing right next to me. Yeah, it's right over Bev. Look. Yeah, it's right there, Bev. Yeah. You're standing right next to me. Why don't you touch me? It's really cold. Are you in here now? They're in here now. She's right next to Bev. Oh, She's look, right next, next to Bev. To me. There. Yes. There, Bev. Wow. Help. Help. Yeah. How can we help? Help. Are you trapped here? It's weird, isn't it? It's with you, Bev. It's there. It's standing up. Yes. But... Yeah, 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 Bev. You, you feel oh, down, down below the bed as well. You're feeling cold? Yeah, I'm cold. Look at that. I mean, I'm very cold, but I know it's drafty up here as well. It's touching to you, Beth. How can we help you? Are wow. you touching me? Are you here? With me here? That's crazy. How do you feel? I feel like something's touching my head again. <laughs> I'm scratching my head because I'm so. But I feel, I feel fine. It's right there on your bed. Wait. Wait. Are you here now? Do you want to speak to Beverly? Yes. What would you like to say? You need help? Are you standing right next to me? It's there. It's crazy, Biff. Mm. It's really, really, really crazy. Wow, there. It's just someone literally standing there, isn't there? It's crazy, Biff. Mm. It's really, really crazy. Wow, there. It's crazy, Biff. Mm. It's really, really crazy. Wow, there. And if you move it over there... It's gone. And if you move it over there... It's gone. And if you move it over there... It's gone. No, a little bit there as well. A little bit, just but here... Look, right on Beverly. Look at that. Wow. Have you a message for Beverly? We've got like a flashing or something over there. Did you spy that? Amanda? Yeah, I've seen that a couple of times. Flashing, flashing over in there. the corner there. 
Repeatedly, we have observed the spirit box articulate Bev's name, compelling us to theorize that some form of spiritual connection may exist. Echoes of the phrase, Bev, I thought you forget me, raises queries about a potential encounter with this same disembodied presence in past investigations. Days subsequent to our investigation, Bev reported disarray within her dwelling and perceived that a spiritual entity may have returned with her as items had been moved around her home. These occurrences cultivate an atmosphere of eerie curiosity surrounding our continued investigation into the unknown. Yeah, I've seen that a couple of times now. You've seen it too. At the corner of my eye, yeah. Yeah, at the and corner I'm of my eye. It's gone. Yeah. It's like just that corner. Yeah. What would you what would you like us to do? How can we help you? Do you want to leave here? Go mad. He's just going mad. Something here. Someone isn't right there? next to you there. No, there is no nothing. There's nothing. There's absolutely nothing. God, you're cold. My hands are freezing, aren't yeah. they? Yeah. Are you standing right in front of me? It's there. I mean, my nose is here. Broken, here. But someone's standing here. I want you to put oh. your hand up. Well, I know it's cold in here. Yeah. See, that light's gone now, isn't it? I haven't seen it. No. no. no it? Since we pointed it out, it hasn't. No. But there's a bit of it. Like a flash. Yeah. But yeah, it seems to have stopped it. I saw it a couple of times. Just chatting away again. But yeah. Very hard to understand what it's saying. That's incredible. That's incredible. Okay. It is. Okay, okay I, we're going to do the. Right, very clear high then. Yeah. Since I'm about to switch it off. Right, should we get, uh, get a bit of a wander? Hi. Should we get a bit. Hi. Hi. So Tony's got the spirit box in his ear, so he's. 
chatting to us. And so. well, there's obviously plenty of stuff going on in the background, and we're picking that up activity on here. Mm. So that there is obviously a lot of people here want to get in touch. I think. Make it out. Did you used to live here? What was that? Ooh. I think that was just. <laughs> How can we help you? Hey. Hey. Have you a message for us? Ooh. Did you used to? Something. Yeah. Something. Did you used to drink here? Something then as well. Maybe you used to help. live it. Yeah? Oh. How? How can we help you? Now, this is the same place as we were. Yeah, and it, that's going mad again. Yeah, 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 three, yeah. Got three lights going on. Okay. Standing next to you, Bev. Who's this? Who have we got here? What's your name? Can we see if you can make a sound for us. Make a sound for us. Make some tapping. Close the door. It's sort of around here, isn't it? Help. Is there a message? Help. Yeah? Do you want to get out? How can we help you? Look, Ray, I've got him here. This is where he was before. This is where he was before. This is where he was before. So, we've got nothing around us. Nothing. Yes. Are you here with us now? Seem to be attracted to you, Bev. Yeah, they are they hovering around here, aren't they? Look, see, there, it's on on you again, Bev. Yeah. How do you feel? Are you feel anything? Yeah, or? no, I feel fine. I don't feel anything really. It's right there. Are you touching You've got me? Nothing there, have you? No. No. It's right there. They're standing here, aren't they? Yeah, they're here. What's your name? Yeah. What's your name? Are you male? I think, I think it's, yeah. Is it a male voice? It's a male voice mainly. Female in the background sometimes as well. I think. What's your name? Look back, are you behind us? Are you standing right near Tony now? Because it seems to have gone here. Gone from me. Oh no, hang on. It's gone. Speak. It's gone. Stop. Speak. Stop. Yeah. There's just so much going on up here. It's. I, uh, it it is, and we we can't quite pin down what actually it is, but there's we feel that there's definitely spirits moving around us, yeah. don't we? Yeah. Yeah. I'm very much out in the open here, so they could be just 
moving around different buildings, you know. Yeah. We're not, um, I mean, this is such a, a, an old place. Yeah. It's got so much history. So many people have worked here. Say hello to us. Hey. Hey. Yeah. There's a few about. Yeah. They're definitely here. They're definitely here. Come on, make a sound for us. Well, I guess we should try a little level, maybe, yeah? We should perhaps try into the kitchen yeah. where the door was banging. Yeah. I'm sure we heard something early, you know, when we were up here. It sounded like a door, like it you said. It sounded like yeah. a door, yeah. Yeah, let's head down to the kitchen. Right there. Yeah. Do you want to speak to me? That's it. So this is like a, it looks like a staff room come training room. It does. But Bev, it has the most magnificent view of the church. It's lit up. Yeah. So that's incredible. And as you've probably heard all evening, it's campanology night. So we have had, uh, yeah, we've had the bells. We've had the bells well and true, <laughs> yeah. I think there's another little storeroom down here. Yeah, okay. See what this is like. Oh, not little, actually. Ooh. It's quite a lot bigger than I expected it to be. Now this room, it has got a slightly different feel to it. And it's going, uh, funny, since you said that, yeah. the meter was going off. It has got a slightly so different it's, feel to it's this So it's definitely, space. Feels different, yes, and the meter's going off. Just wonder if they're. Yeah. Oh, oh. There. You getting that? Right in front of the yeah. window. Are you looking out the window? Oi. Oi. Yeah? Are you sitting on here? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Oh, you you got Stop. something there. Stop. Oh, very clear. Stop. That's yeah. A, you now, it's, it's funny. We've been the other room next door to this. It, there was nothing. There's nothing. This we came in is... here and immediately uh, we got that yeah. sense of something in here. And look at look what's going on. They're right there. There's nothing here. If I sit down here, am I sitting next to you? Perhaps they call him Bob. Robert Crofts? Bob? Bob Crofts. Bob, are you here, Bob? Get up. Get up. So it's quite, it's a, it's a lovely space, isn't it? It's great. It's really good. Projector. Oh, dead. I think dead then. Yeah? Yes? Who's dead? Do you not real, realise you're dead? Sit down. Yeah. I'm going to put this on record. This is a soft piece of, well, it's an app we downloaded, which is a very sort of uh, sophisticated, um, sensitive recorder, which should, if possibly, pick up some EVP. 
yeah. messages. We'll ask a question and then. So we'll we're going to ask a question, mm -hmm. record it, then play it back. See what we've got. So then, do you want to ask a question, yeah. Beverly? Here we'll press the record. Uh, so we're now recording. Is there any spirit people here? Voices, can't you hear that? What is that? It it's, was, there was like, like a laugh halfway through that, and it's almost like rustling. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, we're, we're sitting very still, aren't we? Well, I think we are, but I mean, it is a very sensitive piece of kit. So, did you pick up anything, Tony? I didn't hear it, no, um, no, okay. Hello? Make, make yeah, I think so because there was definitely something there, wasn't there? Okay. It's like a, it's like a, yeah. It's like a room. Listen. Listen. There's definitely something there. Yeah. I can hear the wheel. It's like a voice. Yeah. I've got something saying look. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I think that was really good. That was good. It was, a good one. It was like a, almost like a question and a it was, like a laugh. Yeah, but it's, it's, I, to me, it sounds like someone speaking beforehand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah you're hearing that. And too. that definitely wasn't us. No, cause I thought we were, we were sitting quite quietly. I mean, I've got the, still got the spirit box running, so all I can hear is that mainly. Um, that's good, I think. But, but yeah, I don't, didn't, don't think. It I think you can use. Thing. I think you can use that, can't yeah, you? Yeah, yeah, that's, that's great. That's. I, mean, I didn't pick up on that at the time. I didn't pick up on that time. No, no. We're going to look in Oops, this room here, which is the kitchen. Now, you was here earlier, Bev, and you were speaking to... She said that they, they, they can hear this door bang. Yeah. Um, and you know and what? It's a I'm really not bang. sure if we didn't hear that bang earlier. We did wonder, when we were in didn't the we? Because it shuts like that. Yeah. But she did say when he hears it, it's kind of like... Yeah. And I, we heard yeah. something like that when yeah, we were upstairs. Heard. Yes. Then. Yes. So are you... Are you here with us? Are, are you the one who's banging the doors? Yeah, because I mean that that is, I mean it's quite a windy night tonight, and that's not being affected no. by any wind. Are you trapped in here? Back. 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 Man's voice. Back. 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 Back where? Maybe back's back outside. Yeah, let's, let's, let's open that door and go outside. Yeah. Oh. Wow. I mean, this is like stepping back into Victorian England, it isn't is, it? It is, isn't it? Is there anyone out here who'd like to speak to us? Anything out here, Bev? I've got a little... Yeah, I, I I've got heard, something, look. I look, 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 look. I was just thinking, over there, it was going mad. There's something standing on here. I mean, this is... Yeah, I mean, this is, this is quite a... There's an atmosphere about this space. It's just, yeah. Like you were saying it was kind of like a Victorian. I mean, what is that there? That's got to be a narrow room there, isn't it? Yeah. It's the meters going off as well. Did you, you used to come down this far escape? Hopefully, we've set you for. We've 
let you out. Oh, yes, very clear, yes. Yeah? You're free. Wow. So we're now outside Fabio's, the rear of the building. And yeah, this is, um, very, Hi. yeah. Yes. Who's here with us now? Is someone here? What's your name? <laughs> wow, this is a what? This is a warrant. Isn't it? it is, isn't it? How are we going? I don't know. Some creepy voices coming through. Yeah. Well, this this is quite a scary. Um, it's got some atmosphere about this space, <laughs> doesn't it? Yeah. It really makes you a bit. It's, it is quite creepy, particularly in the dark. That's horrible through there. You might be able to pick something up on there, Tony. Because what at the moment, I don't know if you're still filming, but we, we can't really hear what's coming through on the spirit box. But uh, we're being prompted every now and again by Tony, who can hear what's coming through. So, But you said there's a lot going on. There is, there is. Still going now. Just speak. Yeah. Speak, speak again. Who's here? Who's here with us? Have you got a name? Do you used to work here? Or one of these buildings here? What's your name? There's so many voices coming through. Am I closing the door? Yeah. Whoa, oh. Oh, there's something around here. Oh, it got all cold then. Yeah, I know. Ben? Yeah? I think you said your name. Hi. Oh, hi. <laughs> Sit down. Oh, yes, very clear, yes. Yeah? Wow, what an incredible building this is. And what a fantastic investigation it's been. I mean, everything happened tonight. We've had voices, we've had sounds. And the meters have been going the crazy. The meters have been going crazy. And I've never felt so uneasy as I did in the cellar. It yes. was just... Well, you've, you felt like someone touched you on the head. It was it definitely something like yeah, on the top of my head there, and it was kind of sort of eerie in that bit, wasn't it? A very very exciting investigation for us. Yeah, no, it's been it's been amazing. So my name's Ray Cordell. This is Bev Kinsey. We are Haunted Hitchin. <laughs> that was Bev. Bev. <gasps> <gasps> Oh! Right. 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 Right.
Oh. Are you here? Yes. No. Yeah. That's moving. Can you go back the other way? Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yeah.